What's up guys? Welcome to episode 2 of this 1977 Datsun 280Z build. Uh, what we're going to do today is we're going to pull out this engine. I'm just waiting on my roommate to get back from Portland, Oregon. He should be here in about an hour or so. But yeah, the plan today is to pull out the engine, get it out, get it prepped, set over to the side, waiting for somebody to buy it tomorrow, and then we can start getting to the real hard work on this thing. But uh, yeah, first things first, I'm gonna tidy up the garage a little bit. This place, as you can kind of see, I've left some tools kind of all laying around. It's a mess and I just can't work like that. So let's clean. Always remember where you guys put your 10 millimeter. You, you guys know, you guys. Well, as you guys can see, I don't really have the biggest space in the world for working on this car. I mean, this is this is really about the extent of how much room I have. But I cleaned up my little section. Um, I at least have enough, you know, space to find my tools, work on my bench a little bit. So now it's just waiting for Ryan to get here. He should be here in about an hour, hour and a half. Uh, we're gonna pull the engine, set it to the side, get that sold tomorrow. I might do a little bit more work on the engine bay later, but I don't know, we'll see how that goes. So yeah, just waiting for him. Here in the front of the engine, there's only two 12 millimeter bolts that hold the engine mounts in, and underneath, just two more bolts that hold the transmission. Previously, before I had filmed episode one, I had already removed the drive shaft, so this is gonna be a pretty simple removal. Put these guys in it, I think. <laughs> Lord of mercy. It's like all, everything. <laughs> Deep in standards for everything, all the extensions. Ryan's back from Oregon and brought himself a, got himself a present while he was there. Yeah. It was, uh, it's like 120 bucks. Nice. So it was 100 bucks more, or 20 bucks more than the Husky set, but like, just infinitely better. Nice. So. Well, as you guys can see, Ryan's back from Oregon, and we're gonna pull this engine. After it sitting here for how many months? <laughs> a while. Too many. All right, so. Time to get this thing out of the car. First things first, getting this cable thing so we can actually pull the engine. Washers. Washers? Yeah. Uh, I need, to wash, I need some stack up washers to probably screw on. All right, now that we basically got that piece on the engine, I'm gonna throw the camera on the time lapse and we're gonna get this engine out of here. Engine's officially out. Thanks to help from Ryan over there. I don't know what he's doing now. But uh, yeah, it's out. See you guys in the next one.